What's up, guys? Welcome to Primetime Polton. I'm your host, comic book writer Mark Polton, uh, writer of Graveyard Shift, U.S. Assassin, Sea uh, Dog and Codename Kill Switch, which our Indiegogo campaign ended a couple weeks ago. I want to thank everyone who backed the book. Uh, you guys came up huge in the end, ended up uh, bringing in close to $23,000. Um, the book's all done. Uh, off to the printer. We'll be getting it back real soon. I can't wait to get it out to you. But today we're here for another $1 movie reviews. And today we're doing Don't Kill It, starring Dolph Lundgren. I was excited when I saw this uh, at Dollar Tree. Um, come on, a Dolph Lundgren movie for a buck? Definitely. Uh, one please, yes. <laughs> so uh, this is like B-movie gold. I'm going to read you the back of the box, let you know what it's all about. When an ancient demon is accidentally unleashed in the sparsely populated Mississippi town of Chicory Creek, the town's only hope of survival lies in the hands of grizzled old demon hunter Jebediah Woodley and his reluctant partner FBI agent Evelyn Pierce. So there you go. Um, it's kind of a little reminiscent of a supernatural father-son uh, demon hunting team. Um, the father dies and the son grows up to be Dolph Lundgren. He comes across this town that has this demon uh, that he's encountered before. It travels from body to body. So like the title says, don't kill it. Um, if you kill it, the demon then travels into your body. Um, kind of like uh, It Follows, except uh, instead of having sex <laughs> with, uh, with the infected person, uh, you kill the person and then you become the demon. But man, like I said, this is B-movie gold. Um, tons of splatter. Um, the opening is nuts. <laughs> there's, there's tons of kills, lots of blood flying. It's digital blood. So uh, at times, like the digital effects can be a little, um, little cheesy. But man, this, this is awesome. And for a buck, you can't beat it. Um, I really like it. I mean, I, I love everything Dolph Lundgren does. I've been a huge fan uh, since the 80s, since Ivan Drago. Um, he took a kind of took a little bit of a mini uh, retirement in the, I guess, late '90s, early 2000s. But he's back with a vengeance now, starring in a ton of movies. Uh, I guess The Expendables is like the uh, the highlight, as well as uh, Creed Two, um, coming back huge with that. But um, he's great in this. Uh, like like the description says, grizzled demon hunter. Hunter. He's uh, he's real surly in this, um, cracking one liners and. Uh, just being a total badass. And uh, that's what Dolph Lundgren is, he's a badass. Um, but I highly recommend this movie um, on the on the rating scale. Now I rate this by uh, dollar amount. So I paid a dollar for this, but I would have paid, I would have paid $6 for this. This is a good movie, I, I like it. If you're in Dollar Tree and you see it, pick it up, uh, it it's gonna be a fun time. But uh, this has been another $1 movie review. Thanks for watching guys.